So we are in the lovely setting and gardens of the Cobbler's Cove Hotel on the west coast of beautiful Barbados. So at the Cobbler's Cove, we've got 42 suites. We have the Garden View Suite. We've got the Ocean View Suite. We have our two bedroom suite, the Ocean Front Suites, as well as our two suites in the Great House. So we have our various facilities and property for our guests to enjoy. We have our main pool, which is in the Great House setting. And this is where we serve our breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Is our main restaurant is located there as well. It's called the Camelot Restaurant. We also serve afternoon tea and we have different evenings. We've got our theme nights, so we have our reggae and calypso evening on Fridays, as well as our easy Sunday, which is quite popular among the locals as well as the visitors. We also serve, if you're having in-room dining, you can choose to do so. You can have any of your meals, breakfast, lunch, or dinner, and even your afternoon tea served on your lovely patio. All of our rooms are nicely equipped as well to facilitate this. Our servers are happy to set you up, um, providing a lovely setting for you wherever you decide to choose to have your meal. So we have our tennis court, we also have a spa, we have a gym as well on property um, and so all these facilities we have for your enjoyment. We also have our boutique where you can find some locally made um, clothing as well as some lovely pieces from other islands in the Caribbean. So we have our local chef, Jason Joseph, and we've got a full team, a house team in the kitchen. Um, truly all very much have their own specialty areas. We also have our mixologists at the bar and they can whip you up, you know, any local cocktail. We've got the cobbler's punch as well, which is quite popular um, among our guests. So, you know, we do our garden tours, we do, um, we do different activities in our, in our gardens. So we do our cooking demonstrations, um, mixologists, um, little demonstrations as well for the guests. So we've got a water sports team headed by truly the one and only Bradley. Um, and these guys are amazing, so they can set you up for the duration of your stay. So whether you want to learn some windsurfing, um, you can also do um, Hobie Cat sailing. They can take you out for, the, for a couple um, hours, if you like, while you're here. We also do the complimentary boat cruise. And if you want to do some fishing, we can arrange that as well. Um, with our fishing expert. So Cobbler's Cove generally open all year round with the exception of a couple months in the summertime and this is when we use that period to refresh the property, do our little upgrades and upkeep of the facilities. Um, we also have our winter season which is generally our, during the peak season as well. So we would open, reopen normally from October, mid-October, and this would generally go right through the season to April. We've got our peak season in there covering the Christmas and the New Year period. Um, then we have the summer months starting from May, and that would generally go until August. So my favorite thing in, in Cobbler's Cove would be sundown. So we are uniquely placed in front of the beautiful Caribbean Ocean and this is the favorite moment for me when you've got the sunset just coming down during cocktail hour. Um, this is I think the one moment that our guests truly appreciate the setting of Cobbler's Cove. So if you are looking for the place to stay in Barbados, Cobbler's Cove I would highly recommend. It's got the beautiful setting, you've got the luxury gardens as well as the ocean front. Um, it's a family owned property which is very personalized. We you know, cater to all of the, our guest needs individually. Um, so I would say this is a place to be. If you want a nice stay in Barbados, come to Cobbler's Cove Hotel. It's wonderful here. The weather is good, the people is fantastic, and the food is off the chain. Cobbler's Cove Hotel, Barbados West Coast. <laughs> love you all. From Barbados to England, you send a big love. Yeah, man. <laughs>